See, I think these are going to be the three for me. Dontrell Ransom uses the library for movies. It's just all about browsing. Again, it's almost finished. Kevin Merritt uses the library to knit or check out a book. The library is an, a place where things are free. Especially after the St. Paul Public Library eliminated late fees. Less fines mean more money in your pocket. It welcomes people to actually come to this location. Which was the whole point. By every measure we had hoped for, it's working. Library director Katherine Pinkert and teen specialist AJ Ragland report a boost in circulation, especially in low income areas where fines had a disproportionate impact. And I get patrons in all the time who are just so happy that they can uh, visit again. Here at the Rondo Branch, circulation is up more than 18% compared to the same time last year. And new card registration across the library system is up more than 8%, the first increase in years. By going fine free, St. Paul has joined more than 100 libraries across the U.S. They are all challenging the theory that fines are a form of personal responsibility and that late fees encourage on-time drop-offs. But there's no research that shows that it actually works that way. Fines also represented just a small portion of the the library's revenue. Keep in mind, if you lose or keep a book forever, you'll eventually still have to pay. It's kind of a system of natural consequences now. So as a lover of the library and someone who always mm. has late fees, I just want to yeah. know, is this catching <laughs> on in like Minneapolis or in some counties? You know, here we've seen it in Washington County for a while. Duluth actually just started doing it. Uh, Hennepin County has talked about it. And uh, some of the other big cities across the country, Chicago, that was a big headliner yeah. uh, just recently when they decided to go fine free. It's interesting that they say there's no real research that this actually motivates people to get their books back in time. So yeah, they figured that this is a better way to do it. Awesome. Thanks, Dan.